hello internet and welcome to Trust Me I Used To Be A Glass Collector. This week I'll be answering the question, should you worry about imponderable questions? Now you've probably heard an imponderable question, but just in case you haven't, here's some examples. How does the don't walk on the grass sign get there? What colour does a smurf go if you choke it? Where does the white go when snow melts? Why is a building called a building? It's already built. How is it possible to have a civil war? Before they invented drawing boards, what did they go back to? How do you tell when you've run out of invisible ink? What was the best thing before sliced bread? Why do people watch Britain's Got Talent and X Factor? Why did kamikaze pilots wear helmets? Why isn't there mouse flavoured cat food? Now that you know what an imponderable question is, should you worry about them? No! No, of course not! Seriously, if you worry about that, those sort of things, what's wrong with you? The sea levels are rising. Meteorites are striking the planet. Simon Cowell is still alive. Come on!